This is Inside Out. Kali, nkwa nizana te ku mkutu kwa febwa SML News Yugi program ya Inside Out. Wofu nilo mkisa, ukuche gerebi ya kwese, ukuche la kuunguru, kwa laga vili kuunguru, tukule cha vili monda, ilanga vili jo, nkwa nizana te, tukenda kuita mubinji, Zesa Simon, Muyanga, Lutaya. Lebo, Neposkovia, Salam Musumba, Vice Chair Person, wa Forum for Democratic Change ateka ati promoter wa PFF, the People's Front for Freedom Director Commission, jia ganyo kuandisa wala kule kule na ulido msajyo mkuru kula ita Jack Sabit, nga ganti abo viva lemye kula chima lemide kukala zafe kula nga vama nitu vata kosa kala zafe teba ina jeva laga they want to confuse our people and I was like, eh does it happen in the Jack Sabit can delineate the Salam Musumbas and say our, they. So there is a, a them versus the we. The historical zone. <laughs> it's quite disheartening. <laughs> yes, that's the one. We have these things with the pain. We have these things with the pain. This is ours. They want to confuse our people. They say, oh, Jesus. What's the way for PFF, Salam? Well, let me first say hello and thank you all our listeners and our viewers for seeking knowledge and for seeking to know and for being versatile and uh, knowledge based. Uh, it's always said knowledge is power and in this knowledge world, uh, knowledge is wealth. It is very revealing the quality of fellow you're talking about, the late Jack Sabiti. No, I'm talking about Jack Sabiti. The late Jack Sabiti. Sabiti lives. The late Jack Sabiti of Ruchiga. He's alive? No, the one of Ruchiga died. Uh, in on the river. Oh, the river. Indeed. Uh, when you make a, ma a mainstream harvest, mm -hmm. the the, 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 what do you uh, call the counterfeit. The after, the after. Uh, no, the counterfeit. You must call it by its name. It's very sad. So you can have a counterfeit person. Yeah. Salam. The chupuri. The chupuri chomo. Eh. We a software ya wam. Amakaya. So when do I tell that the Salam Musumba I have is the original or the Makaya? When Salam Musumba, the one you know and the one you expect, uh, becomes a photocopy and a bad one of what you wear. Once upon a time, Jack Sabit was called the Lion of Rochiga. It's so not even a baby cub anymore. It's no longer even a cub. Just because you have disagreed. No, I, I don't. I, we, we, disagreement is okay. But the things you say hmm. uh, reveal who you are. I don't need Jack Sabit to call us, they, and him who. So, it is a great pleasure that uh, I'm here to talk about who we are and what we are and where we are going. Um, I, as the founder member of Forum for Democratic Change, I'll never assist. stop reminding you. I am. You know that I was the f chairperson and the president. And that issue has been raised. No, you can't. That is why counterfeits exist. That they try to overwrite history, to rewrite history, and they fail miserably, and they become empty space. Because this history is made in our times. 20 years we will be the 16th December, and we intend to write our history of two decades. FDC makes 20 this December? Yeah, this December, 16th. And you're still planning for FDC? Yes, so because sure. I am. You see, I am. There's nothing you can do about it. How are you going to serve two masters at a go? I'm not. I'm serving one. And that's FDC and complete my term and dissolve the party and then get on to other things. Dissolve. Yes. How many times am I going to tell you, Simon Miyang Alutaya, that we are dissolving FDC 
so that all of us walk our ways. We cannot basically create a, a, a platform we formed on broken bones, dead bodies, prison sentences, you know, kidnaps, and let it be eroded uh, by the talk of such a, of such a fellow like the late Jack Sabit. You can't. I mean, w there's something called respect. I, I want to imagine that the word late is the slip of the tongue. But no, you know, I am using to... it uh, knowingly. Because they are dead working fellows. And anybody who talks the way you have described for yourself is dead. His conscience is dead. So he's not even a leper. Because it's only lepers that don't feel, that don't see. <laughs> that he, he is beyond that. So, to respect the dead, and there's so many people that uh, made such a huge contribution to a struggle. I suck sacrifice. Yeah. I remember sacrifice. the trouble in Chirinya Road. Oh my God. Those young people who lost their lives were being prison. You remember that day Dr. Besiji came back from Nairobi. Uh, where he had uh, been receiving treatment the day that there was taking of oath at Kololo. That 12-hour drive from Entebbe, which is 20 kilometers, 27 kilometers, it took us 12 hours to get from Entebbe to Kampala. There's so many people that died. And the art of the atrocities then was that if, 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 if you drop in the stampede, uh, there were, there were <coughs> so-called ambulances uh, that were following us like Red Cross ambulances. They would pick you and, and, and the police ambulances, they pick you, they throw you in so that there's nobody count. They throw you in and you, know, you are never seen and you are never accounted for. So those many people, their hope, their aspiration cannot be eroded just by a pack of fraudsters uh, Don't you think the greatest enemy of these people, of those people, is you who wants to dissolve something they died for? What then will you tell them Listen, when you meet to them? Uh, you will talk to me two years from now. I know that, and you will know how f the foresight I had in saying, "Listen, you do not damage a good thing. You store it away, and you keep it." Uh, the the, the Bazungus call it keepsake, something you treasure. And we treasure that history, that 20 year history uh, of our political encounter and our political life, and the political life of Uganda. That we want to preserve it, not to erode it. Would you in any way blame President Seven for the troubles that have befallen your party? Why would I blame him? I wouldn't blame him because you bring danger to yourself. So you agree that you destroyed your own self? No, we did not destroy ourselves. Even that outer enemy used internal elements to cause this. Because we had fought, fought the external enemy for 20 years. So the problem is within. Is within. The enemy within destroyed us. The enemy within? Yeah. The enemy within. And that history is written in indelible ink. You don't, you don't have to ask so many things. There is no rocket science about it. And you see, this story is not over yet. I keep telling you that you ain't seen nothing yet. You are yet to see more things. You, are. you have encountered your first stumbling block. Mm -hmm. The US Electoral Commission has refused. And you think we didn't know? Just... We set them up. What are you saying? We set them up. You knew they were not And they it. fell for it. Hopeless. We set them up. We knew. But they were not registered. Yes. We knew. As we walked there, we knew. But you see, you Ugandans don't know. So we have to create a, a, a paper trail for you to know what you're dealing with. So you. You knew. We knew. What they would say. We knew. And you went ahead? We did. Because you see, what when you're dealing true. with a community, because now Ugandans know. Even the blind can see. 
So you have entered the league of Tuvalabise? No, no. You see, exposing the machinery uh, that is working tirelessly to disable multi-party democracy in this country. That machinery has actors. They, they use institutions. And, and if we were to tell you that these institutions are, are, are dead and that these institutions are disabled, just by me talking, you will not understand. You black man will not understand. You can't understand until I touch you. That is what you are made of. <laughs> also, <laughs> you believe in touching your Thomas the Delta. What comes to my mind always is the two steps forward and the, the two steps forward and one step backward fear. Of who? Of you and no. your politics. You guys, where do you live? You walked into Pirao mm -hmm. yourself. <laughs> Where are you now? <laughs> what did I say? <laughs> God, God, I told you. <laughs> I'm telling you that listen. Pirao exists. Pirao is the land. <laughs> you are not objective. So you are not objective. You are catapulted. <laughs> this Pirao is not the individual. <laughs> this Pirao is not the individual. It's the aspiration. Yes, which is you live. Listen. You, you, you pursued your aspirations on the wrong vehicle. Really? And that is why you parked. Because I never you parked. Pa you parked. I never 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 parked. I Make, history doesn't make us. We make it. And so, please, learn from... We are doing Pilar, we are doing BFF. <laughs> the spirit, <laughs> not the individual, we don't know about that. The spirit, the spirit, the spirit, the spirit is there. We are fighting corruption together. No, what are we saying? What's corruption? You are made of corruption. Corrupt, through and through. That's you are baptized corruption. But we are bold enough to say we are fighting it. Mean that we have we the will to fight it. What? We can fight it. Because we know it's an evil. So what have you done? Our time is, has not come. When is it? We are setting up. When we are it? building. But if Salam is going to is crumbling, we are not a one year old. Been, you see, then don't use that parameter for measuring. We are living in a crooked world. In a crooked Uganda. You see? where institutions are intentionally uh, detonated, where institutions don't allow themselves to grow, okay? And so, if you, if you get damaged, you re-engineer yourself. So, we are in the process of that. And let me tell you that we have different <coughs> modules at play. This one, for electoral commission, we set it up. I think the Lord Mayor should tell you the last time he went to Electoral Commission, the entire commission fled. They fled. They fled. They are fleeing. Why? The chairman they was, a, was safe. With. They don't want. They want to deal with a mad, a mad group. No, but they don't want mad. That's what they look at. The Lord Mayor mad. But they are, mm, the bad people have come. Yeah. We have so that, is why, that is why the misunderstanding of public office is when you are in public office, it means exactly that. If you're man enough, go set up your private office. They have and to then, no, no, no. You have said you set them up. So yeah, they are going to flee because but you see, they also English is also a problem. Your English is a problem. When I set you up, I set a booby trap there and watch you. If you work by the rules, you work professionally, those traps won't catch you. Because the professional uh, provisions and the standards provided for never lead you into that path of a booby trap. There could have been a counter trap. Nothing. The lady you see, trap for the you. biggest problem we have in this country is that people speak English without understanding it. 
when people go to school and are never educated, and that people are vagabonds in public office, total vagabonds, why do you think Samaka the one? Ugandans are sick and tired of this vagabond uh, 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 educated idiots. They are sick and tired. But do you know that you and Dr. Besige, five years ago, yes. asked Mr. M7 to appoint a judicial officer, somebody at the level of a high court judge, really? to manage the Equal Commission. As part of the, the reforms, he appointed one exactly. He did not do so according to the standard set. And listen, we could never have approved it because it is the same Justice Biabakama who presided over the fake allegations, the fake trumped up charges against Dr. Messenger of rape. Him. Do you remember asking for a high court judge to manage the commission? <laughs> Not the kind of the Abakama. Because that one too was supposed to be evaluated. We have guys, we had guys like Egona Tende. We had guys like uh, it mean, was not about individuals. You said somebody at the level of a high court judge or a high court judge. So you laid the trap, then they should lay the trap for you. No. They have given you a high court judge. Do you know why? Do you know why we are different? Tell me. Even when we are so good. Tell me, Salah. Because of the software in us. What do you stand for? Who are you inside you? Who are you? You could be a rotten potato inside you. You could be a cleansed potato inside you. It is your actions that say who you are, not what you proclaim by mouth. It's your action. And it's exactly the actions that we are auditing today. Salam. Yeah? It is hard to manage the electoral commission, just like it has been hard for you to manage FDC. Come on. Do you know why they earn that amount of money? Tell me. And do you know why they have that security? And that guy, do you know that he earns two salaries? I don't believe you. Don't. It can't happen in this government. It does. It's illegal for anyone you know to that? salaries from yes. the government. Yes, and that's how illegal it is. Because I'll tell you that uh, the Lord Mayor went to court on behalf of FDC to challenge that. You know, I can ask him, you come at this. Ask. Ask him. Do you listen, to listen, this? Listen, this is not something that I make up. Go find out. If I am wrong, then I am wrong. But I'll tell you, we went to court about that. And you think this government can look on as one draws two sides from the consolidated fund month after which, month? Which government are you talking about? That's how it was set up to be. Personal to hold Do you know what retired judges take home? They, they take And they are retired they victims. The of what they and they are retired are. victims. Get what? The victims of their mis missteps and misjudgments. But anyway. How is that? How is going to run government with those kind of inconsistencies? We'll streamline it. Because we know the inconsistencies, we have been victims of those inconsistencies. So we know best what is at stake and what is wrong. So, what's the way for PFF? I'm waiting for the <laughs> final letter. One thing I found in you, Salam, yeah? you never accept defeat. You don't lose a judgment. You don't lose but a listen, <laughs> why would that be? Why would that be? You cannot pillow, sir. Samuel Miyangaltaya, you cannot defeat a good cause. You can't. That is ours. Which one? The pillar one you are talking about. Yeah, it is the night. You were disbanded midnight the other day without a meeting. Who disbanded us? The owner. And he has even now registered it as a what? Registered it as a, as a company. Didn't you see the registration but yesterday? You think PFF is not registered as a company? No, but you we are not. You must register a name no, as sir. a company registry with the promoters. Did you see any shares there? They said number of shares, new. Sir, this is the order. You know it. You cannot register Pirao or PFF without reserving a name at your recipe. 
He knows. No, sir. It doesn't. How have you registered well. PFF? We have registered PFF in accordance with the political parties and organizations. You must first reserve a name. No, you are you are creating your own law. This is why you take the whole country off course, off track. This is why we must bang the table to get back on track. Bogus you. You are so happy for some of that. I am very happy. Hmm? I, I was, you know, Saturday, I was at the barrio of Father Grimes in Namasagali. After mass, I was busy checking, tweeting, what is it, how is it, how is it, how is it with Sema Kade and banging the table and getting on track. When the good news came, I had a beer. Happy for this country. That finally somebody who understand, who understands what needs to be fixed is in the right place at the right time. And those 2,000 <laughs> people that voted him, 2,000, have a story. They have a, a situation they want to fix. And they got their day. Congratulations, guys. Keep going. Don't what let what does he bring on table? Rule of law. Back on track. You know, rule of law is different from rule by law. They are losing the right. Rule of law and rule by law. That's how it is. I'm you really know, happy with this country. Well, as I may have all the best wishes for Semakade, mm -hmm. I, I see no capacity in him to change this. This is not you a see, he, he, has, he has demonstrated capacity and capability. He can only talk about it. He has done. He, he can't has, fix anything. He can. He can only talk. No, he will. Within his ambit. Within talking. his ambit. You have talked for 20 years and fixed nothing. I'll tell you something. 20 years of talking and I fixed was nothing. A, I was a chairman of Kamali District Local Government for how long? Two and a half years. Correct. And I sorted it out. I did. Just work there. You sorted it out within the framework of the system that exists. I straightened the you elbows. You, you, you know said I straightened the elbows, I straightened the hands which were crooked and crippled. And that's all we are required to do. Straighten up things, back on track. Within. Of course. You mean the law is bad? You mean the institution is bad? No, sir. They are saying, listen, you have misled us. You have taken us off track. We are now getting back to track. Uganda Law Society is like Kenya Law Society, Tanzania Law Society. Okay? And if you care to know that Kenya was very bad, its, uh, it's, uh, it's judicial arm was so bad, they cleaned it up themselves. And today we talk about the judiciary in Kenya, which is valuable, which is competitive, which is a pride to the nation. And this is what we seek to do. So the renewal, the re-energization of, of the law society through the election of Semakadi, their own, they did not import from Kenya or anybody else. Is it not disappointing that you, Salam Sumba, mm -hmm. a political role model I have looked after for so long, yeah. cannot tell the difference between governance and activism? And when they both are together, they serve the best output for our country. That's why I took Museveni to the bush, if you forget. That was rebellion, not activism. It was activism at the extreme edge. You know, there's a continuum. Do you know what called continuum? Oh, yes. The continuum is a scale. It tells you from zero to 10. War is a secure, is, is secure as peace, and peace avoids war. So the scale of what, listen, within the ambit of the law, we are not implementing, we are not executing as should. And so, why do you think 2000 legal brains, they are called learned men and women, why do you think it was their mission? Why? The, the elites and intellectuals have always done that and led us nowhere. What have the professors in Makerere 
done to change our politics. They always do the talking, they like his thinking, but they are far away from reality, Salam, you know. Give me a name. Semakade. Give me a name of the professors you're naming. Do you know the professors we have? The police no, are politics? No, no. The Ndewe no, no. are there. Uh -huh. The professor no, they are not Mkwaya supposed are to be. They are not supposed to be actors. Uh, any university is a think tank. You don't know that? A think tank. They do the thinking. The Aristotle. The refining, reading society. Okay? And redefining roles and... That is what intellectuals do. Both... Semakade mm -hmm. and Malema Bilis have done activism. Yes, and they've succeeded in getting where they are at the table and wait for them to bang the table and wait for them to get back. You also have faith in the, the, the relative of bang the table and the I'll tell you something. Sema. I worked with Semakade in FDC. Oh, he has roots there. Yes, he's from FDC. I sat with Semakade in meetings. I understand the cycle of Semakade. Oh, yes. You have that blind faith in the guy. No, I don't have blind faith. It's blind faith it's in the guy. It's called legal activism, and that's what is the chosen. And activism is activism. It starts at that and ends at that. It's just that, you activism. See, that is why you don't that's understand. If you, if you had read the history of ANC, African National Congress, you mm -hmm. would understand what activism. If you read uh, Gandhi's theory, non-violence, mm -hmm. that looks like uh, I have read totally those. green. I have read those. And you wouldn't be saying that. I have read those, saying. but you know, but you say that activism mobilizes, activism mobilizes can not work in the law. It works. In the legal fraternity, it, it can not work. There is even medical activism. Yes. That is why you got HIV AIDS medication patented at low price for South Africa to treat its population. If you knew that, it was activism that led to that. UNAIDS had to do something, and the pharmacists had to reduce the price. They said, listen, you cannot trade those bodies, and you cannot trade knowledge. We have populations that are about to be decimated by HIV AIDS. And it took medical activism to get medication, even these ARVs, to come here for India to get permission to use the patents of USA. Legal activism does self-renewal of the institution inside. <laughs> you know, I'm still asking myself, yeah. there's been a lot of excitement from especially the political opposition about some of those uh, uh, victory. Yes. It, it appears because to me see, that they are not looking at him as the leader of opposition no, in the country. We are not. We have, have left, left him to Listen, be. we have left him in that. Because he's speaking for us and for the institution and for the profession. Come to me six, the month after he has assumed office, mm -hmm. you will tell me that he will be speaking a different language. Yeah, we will discuss that when it happens. When it happens, we shall discuss it. But should I expect it? Listen, the man has an agenda. Um, I, have you ever worked with Semakad? He's my friend. Then you don't know him. Maybe he's just an acquaintance. You don't know him. You do not know him. And if he, if he ever veers off, I'll give him a call. I'll look him out. I say, guy, you're off track. Get back on track. <laughs> the inside out is Proskovia Salam Musumba, the vice chairperson of the Forum for Democratic Change and one of the lead promoters of the People's Front for Freedom. <laughs> where, did you, where did you find uh, me as a lead promoter? Hmm? By your appearance today. Okay, thank you. By your appearance today. Okay. Even when the commissioner said you have no right to use these colors, as of now, uh -huh. you are dressed in the same colors. I am good. This is not used to be. This is cool, royal blue and white. Royal blue and white. Why do you have to struggle for blue? Well, for commission, issue? because we want blue. Why? Blue is the color of Mary, if you don't know. Mary, 
the queen of apostles, the queen of martyrs, the queen of peace. It's not a religious institution. We are just like a political party. You see my rosary is blue. Are you going to say How do you relate it to? Because blue is a color with meaning. And we have chosen royal blue. We chose a sky blue for FDC. Now we are talking about royal blue, royal politics, royal refined politics, you know? Royal. Did you explain that to the commission? That do they have any understanding? I mean, if they cannot distinguish between royal blue and sky blue and blue. Because Gemma has the blue. inside out. Blue. <laughs> Mr. <laughs> Simon Moyanga Lota Poskov Yasalam Sumba is a very interesting politician and I have learned to, to live with, with, with her. This is Insider.